it's time for the Jackson, Mississippi Bottle Show. Of course, they got a lot of other things, not just bottles here. What's the name of And there's a lot of signs here as well. 10, 18, 20 through 1880. Those are. And surprisingly, a lot of people are selling records at this show. Vintage maps and all kinds of science. It's almost a sign show. Plenty of jars also. And we've got the famous jar doctor for all your cleaning bottle needs. Plenty of bottle brushes, which are kind of hard to find these days, so I picked up a few of these. Poppers for tumbling. Other supplies. stuff you can contact them by this polishing compounds of many different varieties most people can't get them off so they're going nice and tight you can try to pull it off the well, that's what I believe. yeah yeah so we, you cut this off so it doesn't obstruct well the problem is on a four inch it's bigger than my plate yeah. you cut the top too yeah then. I cut it down to when I was 12 to 18 years old, but then it got too illegal to dig from, so I decided to take up bottle digging. <laughs>
I'm sure he is quite strong. Mind if I make a video of this? Some of the shiniest ACLs I've ever seen are on this table. Plenty of bottles off of here at one dollar. collecting ACLs for 31 years and I've never seen this one before. Look at that. This crate holds 28 bottles instead of 24.
ties the show. Let's see what I recognize here. I actually went into an antique shop a couple months ago and saw one of these for $22. They got $445 on that one. I always wonder how do they hand paint these with enamel to come out so perfectly. I don't know if any person alive today could do it. A nice label under glass whiskey. And she has good ones too. She helps to Go back. 
back through years and years of heartache like we did. Even plastic shampoo bottles are being sold here. Yeah. They are pretty neat. I don't see these very often. Deal maker, not okay, me. Those two? Oh, I didn't even know.